damn bright. I think the tone for Naked Souffle is we're going to push it as close as we can to the edge of taste, push the envelope while remaining funny. Because if you go too dark, it's not funny, and it's kind of, you know, and then it's just sad. But if you go with like a Ricky Gervais cringe social awkwardness, I think that makes it funny. So we wanted to have it really focus on like this guy exists. These characters exist in this little microcosm, this little universe, this little town of Coward Lake. We want everybody to feel like a three-dimensional person, like they really exist. They have histories, personality traits. They're not just they don't come on screen for one second, say a punchline and then leave. We're trying to explore different perspectives, like characters that may seem weak are actually going to be strong and the reverse could happen for strong characters. We're just trying to innovate in a way that people haven't seen, show people something new, because let's face it, what's out there isn't that great. The strip club itself is kind of a character, and a lot of times strip clubs are thought of as dank, dirty places, and like, who would ever set a comedy there? So we thought, well, who would do that but us? So it seemed like a good idea at the time, and it still is.